Hi everyone, this is Shannon from theirishscrapper.com and today I have another um, simple card for you that was inspired um, from Pinterest and I will actually um, put a link or the picture of the original card. Um, I think it was done by Ladybug Designs um, but it just happened to come up in my Pinterest feed and um, her original was black and white which was nice so I just wanted to change it up a bit. Uh, today we are using uh, Very Vanilla Basic Black in some of the um, Playful Palette Designer Series paper. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, I have everything already pre, some of it um, pre-cut. So I will put all the dimensions as well as the products used on my blog. Um, so you can check that out at theirishscrapper.com. Um, so first... Um, we will start with the card base. So this is our Very Vanilla. That's the standard A2 size. Uh, we have a black layer as well as a, another piece of Very Vanilla. So we can actually get those uh, adhered down. So let me get my Fast Fuse. Oops, sorry, I bumped the camera. Okay. Let me see if this is straight. That looks pretty good. Okay. And then here is our very vanilla. So we have that portion. Um, I have a piece of the designer series paper from Playful Palette and it's about one and a half inches wide and I'm going to put that in our triple banner punch and flag that edge. Um, if you don't already have the triple banner um, punch it is very nice. Um, you can tell here from the front you're allowed to put in um, three different widths up to two inches, so one, one and a half, and two. Um, but I've even used it um, without sliding my paper in, um, just doing it, you know, from the outside. Um, so it does come in very handy if you're looking for something easy and don't want to uh, do your flags by hand. Okay, so then a couple other things we need to do is with the big shot. Um, so first, I will grab that. Make sure I have enough room here. Let me just get this. We are going to cut our butterfly. So I'm going to switch my platform. I'm going to bring in the magnetic uh, platform with one of my cutting pads. And we are using the Butterflies Thinlet Die. And we are using this butterfly. And I'm going to use a piece of scratch um, piece of the same designer series paper from the Playful palette. I'm going to line that up and run this through. Okay, so you can see here is our butterfly and I will uh, take a few minutes to pop that off out, off of camera. And then the other thing that we're going to do is emboss. So I'm going to replace my um, regular platform with a cutting plate. And we are using the Softly Falling Embossing Folder. And I have a piece of basic black that I'm going to set inside this folder. And I want a little bit of, um, you know, different dimension. So I'm putting it up. So I get a little bit of the um, less lesser dotted pattern and then a little bit more um, towards the bottom. So we will get our other cutting pad on and roll this one through. shot out of our way. Okay. 
Okay, and then here is our piece. All right, so let's bring back the card, and let me just take a moment to pop this butterfly out. So now we can continue uh, to assemble. And also, um, today Stampin' Up! released a new um, promotion for the month of July. Um, so please visit my blog. It is called Bonus Days. Um, so it's basically for every $50 you spend um, in the catalog before shipping and tax, you will receive a $5 coupon via email to use in August. Um, so there's no limit on the amount of coupons you can receive, which is great. Um, so if you've been creating a big wish list, um, it's definitely the time uh, to place that order and take advantage um, of this offer. So please um, visit my blog. I do have the details there. Um, and that begins on July 7th. So two days from today. It's actually Tuesday and I'm recording this, but you guys won't see it till Wednesday. Um, okay, so I put a little bit of fast fuse on the back of our banner. I am going to lay this flush with the very vanilla uh, top layer. And then I'm going to add some adhesive to our black square. And since it's embossed, I'm putting a little bit of fast fuse around all four sides. Okay, and then I will put that about there, looks good. I hope I have that straight. Okay, and then we have our butterfly. So I'm going to actually grab a few glue dots and put that on our butterfly. Oops, that one I got a little bit off. Let me just adjust that. Okay, and then I want my butterfly not to set off too much because I do plan on using an envelope. Um, so I'm going to bring my butterfly down a little bit so I'm still okay with uh, putting it in an envelope. And then I'm going to take some of our basic rhinestones, and I'm doing about five of them. And I'm just going to cut those out. And let me find my paper piercer. Hopefully I can get these all at once. All right, and then for our sentiment, set this aside, I am using uh, flourishing phrases and we are going to use just a note and thank you so very much. Um, so I am actually going to stamp those in the Memento Tuxedo Black. So I'm going to do just a note on the front. Make sure I'm straight here. Okay. And then on the inside, I am going to put the thank you very much. So let me just ink this up. Looks good. Let me close that. I want to try to get off that crease. There we go. So there is our uh, cards for today. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Um, if so, please subscribe or leave me a comment. I do love to hear from you guys. Um, and if you do have any questions, please let me know. And visit my blog um, to see the product list um, and dimensions, as well as more information on the new bonus days that begin July 7th. Thanks, thanks so much, guys. Bye-bye.